guys and welcome back to my channel thank you guys for watching my previous videos I really appreciate it but I love the comments and all the shares and the likes so today we are doing a slow cooked pork stew so as you can see I have all my mise en place already cut up and ready to go so here's what we have we have some yellow onion butter beans pickled jalapenos, sliced carrots, yuca, acorn squash, bok choy, tomatoes, and a little pepper. We also have for the meat part, some pork shoulder. Uh, I took some, some of the fat off and I just marinated it with some orange juice, mustard, Salt, pepper, dried spices, dried herbs, and olive oil. And I will also be adding some Goya olives that already have the peppers inside. Okay? And of course, our handy dandy crock pot. So I already have it on, hi, it's getting heated, and we will get started. Okay, so while our pork is searing, I'm going to start layering in some of the vegetables so I can have everything kind of cooking together. So I'm going to start with the acorn squash on the bottom. Put all of our acorn squash inside. Then I'll put the yuca. I'm going to drop the pepper in now on the side. Put the beans in. The jalapenos. Add in the bok choy towards the end and the onions I'm going to sear, saute with the pork right now. Now I will add in the pork. no oil I did not add any oil this is just a natural grease from the fat as it rendered from searing okay so all of this round stuff here it's very good it's very essential to flavor and uh, good for the stew as well so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some water in here just regular water boil it and let it and scrape it up as it starts to boil and I'm gonna add that water right into so I can cook. Okay. Okay, so our water has come to a boil. And let's add it into the pot. So I'm 
gonna have to cover this and let this cook and I'll be back with the finished product okay guys so our stew has been cooking for about six six and a half hours so let's check it out mm. all right so this is exactly what I wanted but it's a little it's a little loose so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna remove the pepper and I'm going to take some of the potatoes that we put inside earlier, the yuca and the acorn squash. And I'm just gonna blend it just to get a little thick paste and it'll help to thicken this broth. Consistency, so this is perfect. So I have some chopped spinach here that uh, it was frozen, so I just squeezed out all the water. I let it defrost, and I squeezed out all as much water as I could. So I'm gonna dump this right in here. rice here, steamed brown rice, and I'm going to plate it up now.
leave some comments, like this video, subscribe, share it with everyone you know, and I'll see you in the next one.